Live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines brought to you by Vantage. Hello and welcome to Thursday's Daily Financial Digest. And here's what's making the headlines in the markets today. Spain's benchmark IBEX closed at its highest since January 2010, following a rally of over 18% so far this year, outperforming other European indexes. Equities have hit multi-year and even record highs this year, as central banks cut interest rates and inflation subsides. Fund issuer Stacked, also known as STKD, has launched an exchange-traded fund touting leveraged exposure to Bitcoin and gold, as investors embrace the so-called debasement trade ahead of the United States presidential elections in November. The Canadian dollar rose against its US counterpart as investors judged that much of the Bank of Canada's potential policy easing has been priced into the market and assessed the likely economic impact of the upcoming US election. The euro-dollar pair made a minor downwards correction in the last session, dropping 0.2%. According to the RSI, we are in an oversold market. The oil fell 0.7% against the dollar in the last trading session. The MACD is giving a negative signal. The gold dollar pair gained 0.5% in the last session. According to the CCI, we are in an overbought market. The dollar gained 0.4% against the yen in the last session. The MACD is giving a positive signal. Australia's employment change will be released at 0 hundred hours and 30 minutes GMT. The Eurozone's harmonised index of consumer prices at 9 GMT. Australia's unemployment rate at 0 30 GMT. The Dutch unemployment rate will be released at 4 30 GMT. Japan's tertiary industry index at 4 30 GMT. The US retail sales at 12 30 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Thursday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.